Probably April Fool's Day. I was going to play an April Fool's joke on everybody and say the website was shut down, but I figured you wouldn't buy it. Been a nice, short, simple week. I like it that way. We will get to tonight's plays and get ready for the weekend. You ready? Here we go. April the 1st, 2010. How's everybody doing? Good. Glad to hear it. Well, the Phils broke spring training today, and Blanton goes down. Sucks if you're a Phils fan. Most of you are probably not, but I am. Well, it's just kind of how it goes, doesn't it? All right. Winner of the week special. Craig, ctsportspicks.com, having a great week. Half price sale for you. And his title is basically, well, show you, that's right, you, the user, the money. Month of April. Calls it April Madness. 159 bucks. Screw that. Party help discount winner of the week. 79 bucks. Can't beat it, can you? Definitely check it out. Craig went down a little bit tonight, had one play, goes 0 and 1, gonna give back 5.5 units to the rest of the guys. Avanti Sports Wagering, 1 and 0. Had 20-dime winner on the over in the NIT final. Everybody was on Dayton tonight, too, which usually means bet it the other way. Sometimes everybody's right. Basher, Dayton, 1-0. We'll add 25. College better, Dayton, 1-0. We'll add 200. Primetime Sports Advisors, PSA wins, 1-0. Add 25 units. Guess who he was on? Guess, guess, guess. Sharp Edge Plays, 1-0, add 35. Big night for this week's winners. 3-0, add 2727 bucks. Dayton, Orlando, and Denver. Not bad, huh? There is your report. Short, simple, and sweet. I'm loving this week. Nice, short, easy week. It's going to get busy come Saturday, though, because that's when the tournament heats back up. Sunday, we got Sunday Night Baseball. I'll wait till we get to Monday. But we'll get into all that at a later time. We are the Internet's number one sports monitor. Tell your friends about us. Got a couple of emails about what they'd like to see. And I'm glad they wrote. Usually I read them, but not tonight. Short, simple, and sweet. Podcast. Definitely wants to hear it. Feels it's a comfort zone between the handicapper and the user. I agree. So we will definitely work on that. We'll see everybody tomorrow night. Welcome to the weekend. Happy Passover. Happy Easter, if I don't say it, to each and every one of you. See you Friday night after it's all over.